Good morning, here we are on Talca Park on a lo lovely Wednesday morning and just wanted to welcome everybody and particularly all the Shells fans and football supporters around the country. We have, we're here this morning with our uh, Sport for All team, which basically is a team of adults with intellectual disabilities r ranging uh, across a wide spectrum. We have young adults with Down syndrome, some people with autism and other intellectual disabilities. But the key thing is we have 60 players that are, uh, that are members of Shelburne Football Club and they're playing football for the club. So they get treated the same way as Damien Duff's a senior men's team, the senior women's team, and now we have a sport for all team. We also focus on a, a person's ability rather than their disability. We have a lot of young adults that are very talented in relation to sports and football, but we also have other people then that might necessarily be a good, but we focus on what they can do, not what they can't do. And the final thing I'll say is that it's essential that we build Shelburne up into being an inclusive club. We already are a very inclusive and diverse club, but now this is another dimension and we've been up and running since 2020. You're welcome, all set. All set for the tour. Morning guys, girls. How are you doing, how are things? Um, I'm Dara Conroy and I'm part of the social inclusion team here at Shelburne. Um, we coach on a Wednesday, every, every Wednesday from 12 to 2 and behind me you can see some of the social inclusion team um, and they're a wonderful part of Shelburne and the base that we're growing here um, and it's only going to get bigger. This is normally where the Shells fans sit and then over there is, see the sign, the Reds? Yeah. That's the Brig Oz Jarrog. That's where the, all the Shells fans that do all the singing and clapping. They're the, we call them the Red Brigade, the Brig Oz Jarrog. And then down the, at the end there is where the visitors go. This is the Shelburne uh, the team's uh, dressing rooms. So in here before the matches, this is where Damien Duff, you know who Damien Duff is? Yeah. Our great manager, right? Yeah. And then we have our, 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 our senior women's team as well. And they won the league and was at the cup final. I have to check my stats there for a second. But I'm just saying, we have a very successful senior men's team and we also have uh, uh, this, a very successful senior women's team and then we have you have the sport for all your team so you're in there you're in the pot with all the big teams my name is Anne Murray I'm the head co coach for our inclusion programs uh, my name is Leanne Walsh I'm the community sport and activity manager in St Michael's house normally on a Wednesday we're down and we're training we do two sessions a week with the St Michael's group. Today they got a little treat because our two year anniversary is coming up. We came down to Tolka Park, done a tour of the grounds with Vinnie McGrath. Um, we got to get up and see the dressing rooms after them all being revamped. And a privilege to be allowed into the kit room today um, to see the memorabilia wall. We have over 50 participants now in the programme. Um, like Anne says, we're training twice a week with Shelbourne. Um, we play a match. We hope to get a match in every month, so we're included in the Football for All leagues and competitions. They just love it. Like They're so proud, they love, they play for Shelburne, Shelburne's their team. Um, there's no mention of St Michael's House, it's like, that's, that's just Shelburne. They play for Shelburne, mm. so, so that, that's amazing. 